one uh, slogan I wanted to ask about before we move on just a bit from information, uh-huh. maybe, is it from bit. Oh. What, what, what does that mean? Who said it? <laughs> John Wheeler. John Wheeler was a visionary. Uh, his great contribution to physics was, he did some good physics, but, uh, but he was not one of the great uh, technical physicists of his generation. His great contribution was a vision and the transferring of that vision to some very, very brilliant students, like Kip Thorne, for example. And, uh, and people. Have you worked with Kip Thorne? No, I know Kip uh, for years, but uh, no. Um, okay, so what was the vision? The vision was that everything could be reduced down to bits. Every physical system could be represented in the language of bits. Even things which apparently seem to be described by continuous fields, because of quantum mechanics, everything could be reduced to bits. Now, he didn't use the word qubits, quantum bits. The word didn't exist at that time. He, of course, meant quantum bits. He could not possibly have thought uh, that it was classical bits. So uh, John Wheeler had this vision that physics could be reduced to, well, we could call it, physics could be reduced to, to, uh, to computer science, quantum computer science, not classical computer science. That has turned out to be very much a, uh, a current theme. It's not just a current theme. It's what almost every uh, physicist that I know who's working on these things believes. So that was a vision. His influence on his students was monumental, uh, not just on the students, but, uh, but many, many other people. And um, so there was a greatness there, even though his own technical contribution to physics was quite modest. Mm-hmm.